the way that I think and I see things and what I'm thinking about directly correlates to where I am. I'm Mari Andrew and I'm a writer and an artist. When I travel, I love to visit cities. I love being in a place where I can really see daily life and actually kind of experience the city in a way as a local. Having chances to interact with strangers is always really inspiring for me. Getting different perspectives. You get into a conversation with someone you would never meet otherwise. <laughs> I think that people think that solo travel would be very lonely, but I found that it actually feels really social, even more social than traveling with someone. I think that it's also a really good opportunity, especially for creative people, to just get to know themselves better. It's almost as though thoughts and feelings have been kind of marinating. That's when the thoughts become something creative. That's when they actualize into something tangible. So I feel like traveling is kind of, it's like the midwife for thoughts. And uh, everything I've been thinking about in the last couple months sort of comes to a head. Here in Bordeaux, I'm working on my second book. I think that they take a lot of pride in their traditions, especially with their wine. I've been thinking a lot about the concept of harvesting and I'm here to learn about the wine process. Something really interesting and beautiful about wines is the vineyard is so old and it takes so much time to make a really healthy one and it can get destroyed so easily. But you still have this beautiful thing that's productive and will change next season. I've been thinking about how that concept sort of mirrors my own creative process. I found that when I really treat myself to a beautiful place to stay, it enhances the experience so much. I feel like I'm in Bordeaux in every room, and um, I love that Hotel Tonight has this curated list. When I'm solo traveling, I feel like I'm just really hyper aware of my surroundings and noticing things so much more because I don't have any distraction. So that's a really beautiful time to reflect. These are the moments that when I think about sort of the highlights of my life, the times when I felt the most alive, full of passion and curiosity, it, it makes you feel like you're a bit closer to the human experience, you're closer to sort of the global community as part of one really specific individual interaction, which is really cool.